Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to Illusion Fox Gaming. Today we are doing the quest Words Are Very Unnecessary. It's one of the quests that grant flight. It's in the Azim, for the Azim step. Tomachog is not in the best of spirits. Hello, Traveler. As it happens, some of the local Quisteri merchants have been dealing with the problem involving your kind of late. Minion is run by the Quisteri. It will not do, to, do you any favors to displease them. The tribe is... Frame, ah, fame for its dislike of speech. They believe that all words are merely lies. The Glisteri way is to show your intentions through your actions. Nothing else shall suffice for them. And yet a merchant from far-off lands has recently appeared in a reunion, trying to force the Glisteri to trade by using the very words they despise. Ignorance is no excuse. I've seen others attempt to explain the local customs to them. However, it matters not what anyone says if you will not listen. I would appreciate it if you were to take responsibility for this buffoon. No doubt he is still in the con's tent, harping on. Yeah, you gotta respect the customs of the area you're in. At least as much as you can. You don't know, hopefully someone will explain. Not as you'd be, you'd fancy taking part in the conversation anytime soon. Would you? If I've done something to displace you, you need only tell me, what? This is who do you happen to be? If you're here to trade, then you'll have to wait your turn. I arrive first. What's that? You're not a merchant? Well, are you aware of the funny customs these Quisir have? Apparently words aren't much use. Only actions will do. I sold as much by members of, of other Ari tribes, but I just can't bring myself to believe it. How can one run a market if they refuse to speak? Regardless, it does not appear that I stand to gain much from continuing to rely on speech. If even a fellow outsider such as yourself is telling me to follow the Glisteri customs, I suppose it's high time I acquiesced. Now think of it, if you're, if you're not a competitor, would you perhaps be interested in working with me? Seek me out if you'd like to hear more. Ah, uh, it's been an eternity since I last had a chance to talk with a fellow traveler. My name's Gascut. I belong to the East Olnard Trading Company, and I've been stationed in the Far East for a while now. I used to work at our Kagani office until a short while ago. Now that Dumbo's finally free of the Empire's grip, you can bet there'll be a horde of merchants willing to point a trade with the newly independent nation. I've always been a pioneer myself and decided that I would make certain I was the first to explore the this new potential trade partner. I brought bags full of foreign goods to impress the locals with. And despite this, I am unable to convince them to even talk to me. They might take a look at my wares. Only they knew what harrowing obstacles I have overcome just to be here. Countless levies paid to pirates, staring escapes from fearsome bandits and beasts. I could go on forever. And what is my reward? The icy stare of a Kusteri woman. Until today, I had never met a lady that thought, thought me anything but a charming gent. As it seems, I alone am not up to this task. I wish to ask for your aid, knowledgeable adventurer. If you help me convince them to trade, I promise you untold discounts on everything I have for sale. I don't need to be so alarmed, friend. I merely wish for you to help me learn about Quisteri customs. I'd not dream of asking you to threaten them or force you to help me with my work. Their culture is unlike anything I've encountered thus far. If I'm able to get anywhere, I must study all the customs and deities that govern their day-to-day -day lives. Only then do I stand a chance of convincing them to trade. This information shall doubtless be equally valuable to you on your travels. Why, if I weren't such a humble man, I would demand you show your gratitude to me for giving you this opportunity. And so that was, words are very unnecessary, which, I mean, usually in most societies, yes, it is very, they are very important, but so are your deeds. And all, like I said, always try to follow customs of wherever you are. Don't expect people to, to speak the same language as you if, say, you go to Spain and you're from the U.S. Expect to speak Spanish when you're there. Till next time, have a wonderful rest of your day. Hopefully we'll see you again in another video here on YouTube or maybe one of our mini streams over on Twitch where we stream nightly. Till then, have a wonderful rest of your day.